Just got out of the shower. We got off work at 3.30. I think it's five o'clock. We're all packed, we're ready to go. We're heading up north and we're gonna bring you along. So thanks for watching another episode of Found But Still Lost. I'm Leslie and I hope you enjoy the weekend with us. Fitzgibbons thinks he can outrun us and not get in the car, but he's coming. You ready to go Fitz? Wanna go? He hates going in the car. He's in. Good boy. Where's his treat so I can give it to him? It's 9.15 and it's so light out. And we have seven minutes to go. How are you? That drive wasn't so bad. There was only like, what, 15 minutes of traffic? What's he eating, Matt? Hey, Fitz, what are you eating? Fitz, it's grass. Okay. I know he likes the deer poop. We made it, Matt's just hooking up our solar panel to the bowler over there. And then I think I might make a Mr. Noodle because I'm, I'm hungry. I feel like meat though, as weird as that sounds. Good morning. We made it up north in like record time last night. Fitz and Nixon did really well in the car. We didn't really stop though. We stopped for them to go for a pee. Matt and I didn't even go to the bathroom on the way up. And we ate some pizza in the car and Doritos. And then we got here and we crawled into bed. And I don't know why, but the whole way up here, my whole body was like aching. So we just went straight to bed. Okay, I have a bonfire here anyways because of all the forest fires that are burning in Canada right now. Which we are totally fine with. We will not have a bonfire and listen to the rules because shit's bad. So, uh, anyways, we crawled right into bed. Fitz and Nixon like to sleep with us. And the bed we sleep in is kind of like a single bed. It's really hard to sleep in even with two people. So, I didn't have the best sleep. I had a hard time falling asleep. And because my body was so achy... It was just very uncomfortable. I'm going to try to keep Fitz down. He's here right now, but he's filthy. <laughs> and uh, I think it's going to rain all day. So what I'm thinking is that I might bring you guys to the library with me. We didn't have any groceries to bring, so I need to go grocery shopping. And I might go get a coffee at um, a cute little store where I bought a cute little hat last year. I think that's kind of my plan. And I had a dream last night that I went to the movie theater here by myself. So maybe I'll do that. But before I get up and get dressed and go pee, I should tell you, I think I'm kind of over this whole like camping thing. We've done it a lot, like a lot, a lot. And I think I'm, I think I'm growing out of it. I don't know. Or maybe just don't want to do it as often. Like maybe two or three times a year would be good. Okay, I'm going to go pee. We'll see you in a bit. And I don't know where we're going to go first. Probably the library. Matt just left <laughs> and I'm going to take the dogs for a quick little walk. Matt said there's a wild turkey on the road so I'm hoping Fitz doesn't find it or maybe I'm hoping he does and we have turkey dinner. We have mashed potatoes and stuffing just no turkey. 
Oh, it's really nice outside today. A little buggy, but not too bad. And it's going to rain for the bulk of the day, but I don't think we care. It looks like he doesn't care at all. I bet you care. Come here. Go, boy. Oh, and I forgot to mention that I didn't end up making a Mr. Noodle or anything last night. I just didn't feel like it. I think I was just like uncomfortable and thinking, oh, if I ate something, I'd feel better. But I just went to bed. I'm going to steal some of Matt's coffee and make myself a cafe mocha. Warm this up a little bit. My coffee isn't bad, it just isn't very warm. But it's pretty good. Mm. Yum. Okay. I'm gonna go write my journal. And I think I'm going to start working on my vlog here. I don't need to be in the library unless I'm going to download my video. So we'll see. I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet. But we'll figure it out. And when I do, you'll be with me. Which is lovely. Okay. Okay, let's get to it. It's damp in the bowler. More damp in the bowler than it is outside right now. I actually just finished um, editing my vlog, so now I'm uploading it. Well, kind of. I'm uploading it to a file, and then I'm going to head to the library and upload it on their Wi-Fi. I feel like sitting on a Vagabond today. You know, just out and about, and still, still getting the vlog done. I don't know. I love being in the bowler. I love being all cozy in the bowler. It's rainy and caca out. And Fitz hates being in the bowler. Because it's like. It's like being in an oversized crate for him. So. Um, he stays outside and gets filthy dirty. And then he brings it all in here. And it's really gross. But I'll be honest. I don't really care. I just. I don't know. I like being in here. I feel secure. I don't know if that sounds stupid, but yeah. So let's go to the library and then I'm going to go grab groceries. I made myself a little grocery list. Um, it's not very big, but I still think it's going to probably be expensive, like everything. Um, and Matt will stay here. I think he's going to work on putting together a dock or something that he wanted to do. And... I don't know. It looks gloomy still. I think it's going to rain. Not the nicest of weekends, but I personally don't care. I just needed some fresh air. I needed to be in a different place than home. And this is perfect. And we are off. Wow! Oh my god, I'm at Tim Hortons and I just ordered a caramel toffee latte. And I think it's Tim Hortons. How much can it be? It's almost five bucks. Like, I'm sorry, you're not Starbucks. You're you're Tim Hortons. Like, know your place. I made it to the library. Ugh. It's actually warmer now, and I feel like I I didn't need to dress like such a bum. I left my coffee in the car, but when I got got here, I had to come and see this. They have a trail. It looks like it's closed right now because they're repairing it. But it looks really cool. I'll show you. But it looks like it's in need of some work. But this is in the parking lot of the 
of the library. So, how cool is that? You know, in a lot of ways, I feel like I could definitely live here. I just can't camp here anymore. I've, I've had enough of, like, the camping thing. But that there, my friend, is the library. Let's go. First thing I get my coffee, though. <laughs> my $5 Tim Hortons coffee. Does it look like a $5 coffee? Maybe. got my video uploaded so that's good one thing off the list now I have to go and pick up wood for Matt he's working on his dock and he sent me a picture it looks really good so I'm gonna go do that and then go buy some groceries wood's going to get cut they were super nice and that was super easy I also found someone's credit card, so I'm gonna give it to the workers here or employees and see if they know who this person is so they can return it. So I'm just waiting for the wood to come out and someone just called me ma'am. What? I know people are trying to be polite when they say ma'am, but bleh. why don't you just say, hey old lady, hey you old lady, you've been looked after? Because ma'am, unless I'm mounting a horse or something, I don't want to be called ma'am. Okay, holy hell, that was expensive. $77 for two bags of groceries. And I chinsed out on some things. I can eat now. I'm starving. Maybe some of these. So this is my grocery haul. This is what $77 buys you at the grocery store. Some containers, Mr. Noodles, two sets of buns, bananas, candy, a few different dressings. <laughs> you gotta get down. Um... Some pasta, some bologna, uh, like a pepperette, like half of one. That's half. And it was $2.19. Um, some kibasa, a salad that Fitz is going to get into. Two pieces of celery, not a whole thing. Olipop was expensive. Um, tomato, onion, nothing crazy here. So Matt has been working on the like pathway dock kind of thing. Oh, it's long. <laughs> um, well, I was out shopping, so he needs help moving it down a giant ass hill that I suck at climbing, let alone carrying. I think he thought it'd be a hundred pounds, so that's 50 pounds each. You think we can do it? Yeah. All right. Can he just do it himself? <laughs> Maybe if you don't go right to the front, the weight won't be so heavy for me to carry. I don't know. We'll try. Oh my God. He's just going. He, he's not waiting for me. Come on, Nix. That's hot. Just saying. That's hot. Good. 
sounds like there's lots of stuff going on today in our little neck of the woods. Okay. Okay, oh, let's go. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Let's go get the thing. Sorry, there's a lot of noise down here, but I hope you can hear me. We got the frame of the dock down successfully with a few minor grunts from myself and Matt was awesome. Oh, and then we got kind of hot, so we got into the river in our underwear and pants. Underwear. But that's the frame and Matt in his underpants. Success. And they're cutting down trees over there, I think. Oh, I love our river. It's so pretty. Honestly, if it doesn't sell, there's a reason and we're just, we're meant to be here. Oh, I love the smell here too. It smells so freaking good. Okay, I'm going back up. Hey, Fitz! No. No, you don't pound on Nixon. That's no. No. Uh, I'm gonna go start making the macaroni salad. Although now I don't even feel like it. But I think I will tomorrow. I might clean out the fridge first, see how much room we have for it. Cause I think we need to eat the shrimp cause I think it thawed that we brought. Okay, let's go guys. What are you doing? You cr don't you jump on him, Nick Fitz. Since I'm in my underpants already, oh, I'm going to take a nap. I had a crappy sleep last night, and I could use a nap, so we're going for it. Matt and I just had one of those moments where I really wish we were filming, because I was laying on the hammock, and... Matt decided to join me and he's like, do you think he could hold, hold both of us? And I'm like, I don't think so. He sat and it didn't hold both of us. We fell. I couldn't get out of the damn thing. <laughs> Fitz is on us. It was so funny. It was pretty funny. <laughs> oh. oh. I'm gonna to attempt to clean out the fridge so that I can make room for some macaroni salad that I just made. And the dogs just ate the rest of the like chicken from a can that you put in macaroni salad. I freaking love that shit. Okay, so wish me luck. Going in deep. It's a bit of a mess. Huh? I like having special drinks though. Like I love vitamin water. This I got in the States and it's probably my favorite um, sparkling water. This today, Matt was shocked to find out that I paid. Why aren't you getting in focus? Matt was shocked to find out that I paid $4 for a Gator Pop, which is insane. All right, I'm gonna get cleaning. Fitz is gonna get watching. And Nixon's gonna get licking. Yeah. Okay. Look how clean. 
Oh, you can't because there's a giant dog that has nowhere to go. <laughs> <laughs> you sit, Fitz. Sit on your bum. Get out of there. <laughs> Let's show the folks. You got yogurt, Olipop, LaCroix. Um, oh, shit. He's going to bring everything down on my head. <laughs> did you have a good day? Yeah, I felt productive. You did really good. You got it's a whole dock the... done. Well, it's on the cheap. But Who I'm cares? Sorry. It's a path that we can walk down. I love it. Maybe we won't be able to sell or can't sell our property now because we have this beautiful dock. Yeah. Okay. All right, maybe we should feed the dogs. That's where the uh, collapse of the hammock happened. Yep, it was a mess. Oh, good. Fitty's going to make it a bigger mess. <laughs> okay. We're going to go down and see Matt's dock and kind of wash up a little bit. Come on, Fitz, leave it. Let's go. He almost tripped me on the way down. Kind of got behind me as I was taking a step and almost went down. Calm it down, mister. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Are you ready to show me? Stop. Whoa, Fitz has no problem getting in there. <laughs> Oh, it's so nice. Mason, do you want to come in? Hi. <laughs> Good morning. It is now Sunday. And I want to say it's like 8.30, maybe quarter to 9. Um, Matt and I actually got to kind of sleep in. We stayed in bed until 7 o'clock. And then we got up and made coffees, fed the dogs, that sort of thing. Uh, the plan for today is we're going to make chocolate chip pancakes. I love a good chocolate chip pancake. And then we are going to probably go down to the river because Matt, as you saw yesterday, completed the little dock that we needed to like get through the muck um, down at the river. And then, then, this is the best part, this is the best part, we're going to go to the Halliburton Fair and we're going to watch a horse pull. I'm not 100% sure if dogs can come, but we're going to bring them. It's an outdoor event, so I feel like we should be okay. <laughs> and then Fitz. And then there's you. <laughs> He's trouble. Anyways, I'm going to read for a little bit. I'm reading Ugly Love, which I know isn't like new to most of you. It's a fairly older book that's been out for a while. And as you know, I'm not like a huge Colleen Hoover fan. Too much of the back and forth, and I hate, hate when there's like letters involved and it's back and forth between letters. I just, I can't stand it. So I will say it's an easy read, so I'm starting to like get back into reading because I had a few books that I just couldn't finish, to be perfectly honest. But I know I'll be able to finish this one, even if I don't love her style of writing. So I'm going to read, and then we're going to make pancakes. Oh. Fluffy goodness, babe. Oh, it's Pam Clark's. Is it good? It's amazing. I think Matt made the perfect pancake. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. It's gonna be good. It is. I think so, too. 
You nailed that. It's maybe 11 o'clock now, and we're down by the river. We've utilized Matt's nice dock pathway thingy, and Nixon is back at his little home on the log. Hey, Nixon, are you happy? Go oh boy, no spit. Here he comes. Don't touch. Go oh boy. We're not going to pop mom's favorite chair. Sorry, bum. Back in the car. It'll just be short. Good job. Oh, you are so lucky, pets. Wait, do you want some water? Yeah. Water is important. that. What drink water? Yeah. I'm not. Oh, look. Good boy. Thank you. Thank you. That's so cute. Cool. Thank you. You're very that's so cute. We got a doggy bag with treats. Mmm. Chris, you're being so good. And we got meat sticks. Same places. Yeah, and like no kind of like. Oh, yeah. They get to with each other. Oh my, oh my gosh, they're so cute. Oh. <laughs> mm. Still a lot. <laughs> what do you got in there, Fitty Bomb? That goat is having the time of its life. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Hello. You can even sit down and sew if you want. Oh, no. No, that I can't do, but that looks amazing. It's not very high tech. There's only two pieces. Maybe oh. the thread. We're just waiting for the horse pull to start. Lots of people, and it's hot. Fitz doesn't know how to sit, but he's doing pretty good. And it's really hot. It's hot. I kind of feel bad for these horses have to, having to pull stuff in the heat. Looks like everyone's here to see the horses pull stuff. I don't even know what they're pulling. I think it's logs of wood, but I could be wrong. Because there's, there's logs over there. And this is their like track, I think, to pull it. Wow. We are back from the horse pull. Oh, it got hot there. So we're gonna go down to the river for a swim. Matt's looking hot. Mm, he's taken, ladies. What? What? He's taken. Very taken. No. Yes. Matt and I got back from the Halliburton Fair around probably like 5 o'clock ish. He's in the trailer, babe. Oh. Oh, you are. And we went down to the river for a little while. Matt had a beer down there. I just sat in my chair for a little bit until I got cold. Cause after like three o'clock, there's not a lot of sun down there. So I came up, um, relaxed, read for a bit. And then um, we made some dinner, which was really just leftovers and crackers and cheese, nothing like fancy. We weren't very hungry after eating ice cream and freezies and stuff at the, at the fair. 
and then ever since dinner we've been trying really hard to stay awake and honestly if it was winter time and it was dark at four o'clock we probably would have been in bed but we're trying really hard to stay awake it's like 8 30 now and it's still super bright out so uh, we could close the curtains and maybe it would look a little darker <laughs> i don't know we're just old farts fitz is pooped nixon is pooped we're all pooped and tomorrow we head home back to reality back to hell it's not hell back to hell it's not hell is it no back, back to hell i do hate leaving fit so during the work week and i hate leaving. actually nixon's fine i'm not gonna say i hate leaving nixon because he's like a cat he doesn't mind being left alone Okay, so I'm gonna read till I can't read. Then I'm going to bed. Are you sleeping on the couch? If you need me to. Oh my god. I don't know if it's worth it because Fitz is just. He takes up the whole bed even if you're not here. Maybe I should put the T R E A T S S away. Because you know too much. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with us for another weekend. I hope you enjoyed the vlog and I also hope you guys have a really great week. We will see you next week with another episode of Found But Still Lost. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.